guys, this is Jill with Crane's Creation, and today, smile, I have <laughs> a very special package. See? Do you all know what this is? You probably do from the title. This is my very own and my very first Pippa package! Yay! And do you all know what's in here? I bet y'all do. Well, as many of you probably seen the other videos that were out there, the Vegemite Challenge, and I accepted it. So, me and Eddie, or Eddie and I, this is Eddie. Say hi, Eddie. Hi, Eddie. We are going to accept the challenge and do the Vegemite Challenge. Okay, so, you want to bring the camera down? A minute. So let's show you what's in here. I opened it up already. Why don't you Sorry. Tilt it. Yeah, tilt it down. Bring it down so they can see the. How far? Keep going. All the way down. There we go. Right there. Okay. So she included. This cute little card. Little card. And it says, Jill, have a magical year. Thank you for taking part in the challenge. Pippa. It was sweet of her to give us a card. We've got the letter. We got our little chocolates. Little tea. And the Vegemite. And we have our toast. Dun, dun, dun. Okay. So I'm going to let Eddie do the Arnold, 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 the honors of doing this. Now you got to do it lightly, okay? Bring it back up before you do that. Bring it back up. Bring the camera back up. Sorry, we're going for another little ride. For it. I'll take my stop. Okay, right there is good. Okay, he's going to be putting it on there. Like I said, just put a very light thing. Oh. So, little note says, your challenge, should you accept it, is to try the Vegemite on camera. <laughs> Insert evil laugh. Vegemite yeah, just do it lightly. Vegemite is a yeast extract obtained from the leftovers after brewing beer. It is essentially the same product as Marmite, but many people argue which of, about which is better. For all intents and purposes, or for all intent and purposes, they are pretty similar in substance. While Australians will seriously caution against ever eating Vegemite, Vegemite on its own, they will equally encourage how delicious it is when used properly by learning the proper proportional use and what dishes are enhanced with Vegemite you can learn to enjoy just as much as any Aussie I don't know we'll see don't eat it plain although it may be common practice when trying a condiment to taste just a bit of it on your finger or on a spoon doing so with Vegemite will likely result in you never wanting to eat it again <laughs> Vegemite is meant to be used as a condiment or a How seasoning. That yeah, looks pretty good. Because it doesn't want to yeah. spread you well. It doesn't spread very well. No. Um, is used as a condiment or a seasoning, not as a standalone food. This is part of why it was. It has such a strong taste because it's meant as a flavor to enhance to to, to add other to other foods. Spread lightly on butter toast. If you often eat toast for breakfast, but you get tired of blandness of butter alone, or you want a salty alternative to jam, Vegemite is a very great alternative. It, compl it complements the blandness of butter very well while adding a rich, salty taste. Mm. Neither one of us likes salt, so that yeah, might be an issue. Yeah. Use it sparingly. This is the most important thing to remember. Vegemite has a strong taste, and it can be pretty unplatable at first. Uh, to enjoy first taste or to enjoy first taste or to acquire the taste over time, be sure to start with a small amount. 
because it is so strong a little bit will go a long way um, in adding taste if you overdo it when if you overdo it when first trying it out you may cause yourself to want not to not want to try it again Vegemite is like any other seasoning or condiment too much will overpower the food you're putting it on and probably ruin it go with just a little and then add slowly Okay. And then she said that she recommends using Vegemite with honey. Um, when she was pregnant with Sophie, um, my husband Marcus inflicted, sorry, love me, butter toast, and then added stripes of Vegemite and honey. We nicknamed them butter bumblebees. Well, we don't have honey, well, we do, but it's in the refrigerator and it's like hard as a rock. So we're just going to go with um, which is the Vegemite itself. Don't try it on its own. Or not. It don't smell bad. Stick your tongue in there. Blah, blah, blah. Did you smell it? <laughs> no, I didn't. Smell it. It's okay. I'm alright. Smell it. Oh. It's beer stuff. Junk. Like. It don't smell bad. I'm going to leave it alone. <laughs> He's going to leave it alone. Okay. So she included the little candies in here to eat afterwards, I guess, to maybe help it out. <laughs> and the tea. <laughs> And I made myself some hot water. I can open the tea bag. I don't want to open. Can't get in the tea bag. <laughs> when all else fails. Okay, Pippa, this tea bag is strong. We can't even open it with the with his teeth. There he goes with the scissors. He's going to get scissors. Be right back. So. He went ahead and buttered. Put just a little bit of Vegemite on it. Hopefully that's not too much. We'll see when we get to taste it. I'm a little nervous about it. Because like I said, we don't like salty foods that much. We don't add salt to anything because we're just not salty eaters. Eaters. So we will have to see. Hurry up! Okay. My camera got full. So. We are continuing on where we left off. Y'all didn't know that though, did you? No, you didn't. <coughs> okay. So here we go. You ready to eat our toast? You ready, honey? Sure. You know at the same time. I'll take this piece with no Vegemite right here. <laughs> you ready? Should I eat some of the Vegemite or not? Yes, eat the Vegemite. I swear to that, we need to just corner right No, you right gotta here. eat the part with the Vegemite on it. I know, it's right there. Mm-hmm. Okay, take a bite. I can taste the salt. Yeah, it's got like a, an odd flavor to it, but it's not really bad. It's salty. Yeah. It's not like that bad, though. I like the whole thing. Oh. Did you know that was part of the challenge? I will. It's not bad. I'm serious. I don't know. The verdict's still out. I've got some of her tea. I made the tea. Tea's good. It's not bad. I don't think I'd eat it every day. I don't think I might not ever eat it again. 
it's not bad though. I mean, it's not like what I thought it was going to be. I was scared to try it with everybody's reactions. Mm -hmm. But it's actually not too bad. Okay. I've got a little piece left here. We're let Lucy try it. Mm. She's behind me. Hey. Hey, I got something for you. You want to bring the can you switch the camera over so she can see it? <laughs> her paw. She's pushing it away with her paw. Right now, just take her in. This is Lucy. Woke her up. Okay, there we go. That's good. Okay, Lucy, you want it? She's sniffing it now. She dropped it. Uh. <laughs> I don't know about that. Nope. Okay, I don't think it's a no-go on the dog. The dog doesn't like it. it mm, Lucy likes everything pretty much. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. She ate it. Touchdown. She ate it. <laughs> she liked it. I ate mine. We have another piece of that tea. This tea is tea's good. Cheers. Got your monster drink, right? Give me your monster drink. Mm. Monster Cheers. drink. Monster. <laughs> okay. Here's the little cookies that she gave us. Look at Lucy. Look at her. It's gone. She did eat it. Yeah. You don't get that. Thank you. Yeah, thank you, Pippa. Look at Lucy. You can't have this. Our first candy from Australia. Mm. Pretty good. Mm -hmm. hmm. Okay. So we had this much left. Maybe we'll keep it out, and I'll give John some for breakfast in the morning. Mm. See if he likes it. I'll let y'all know. <laughs> Um, we went back and watched some videos, and there's actually a bunch of vid videos out there on the Vegemite Challenge. These idiots, one of the challenges, the idiot, I shouldn't say idiot because he might, they might, you know. Mm. But this guy had the whole Vegemite, and his challenge was to eat the whole jar. He had one spoonful, stuck the whole spoon in his mouth, and about threw up everywhere. So he didn't make it. But it's like, don't follow the directions. Use it sparingly. And if you look up Vegemite Challenge, you'll actually see um, some stars have actually tried it and done the Vegemite Challenge. So it's interesting. Look it up. I'm not going to mention names or anything, but look it up. Okay. Well, I want to thank Pippa for sending this to us. Yes, thank you very much. Um, we do appreciate it. And just remember, I will accept pretty much any challenge that comes at me. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Both of us will. Yeah. He's a good sport. I'll try mm -hmm. anything once. Promise. Yeah. So if y'all have anything out there, then you want to challenge us. Okay, well, let me know what you thought of this video. Um, remember to like, comment, and share if you would like um if 
you like to see more of these videos or more of our videos or and me and Eddie together, you know, subscribe to our channel. If you would like to see Eddie more in more of my videos, Remember, comment below. Remember, it's a adult, you know, non adult children, only. so anything you want to see. Oh adult. my God, shut up. <laughs> So if you want to see, if you like to see this goof goofball in more videos, comment below and let me know. Comment also let you know what you thought of this video. And that will be it. I will see y'all later. Thank you. Bye. Bye bye.